In Consumer Corner, we take a look at trends creating a buzz here in China. On today's show, we'll discuss high-quality counterfeit luxury products. The luxury products market has developed very fast in China these years. An increasing number of Chinese consumers are keen on buying luxury products at home and abroad. So many luxury producers and store owners are giving more attention to China's market. Chinese consumers' strong consumption ability can also help boost the international luxury market. Owing to the anti-corruption campaign carried out last year, the luxury market in China was affected as well. But even so, China's luxury sales still reached 96 billion U.S. dollars. It ranked first in the world and made up about 29% of global sales. The large market and its huge potential has gotten the attention of manufacturers who mainly produce counterfeit luxury products. And these knockoff luxury products have taken up a pretty large amount of market share as of now. Data shows the fake luxury products market now makes up about 7% of the overall luxury market. The counterfeit luxury market is estimated to be valued at over 20 billion U.S. dollars. This while the global luxury industry is worth about 320 billion U.S. dollars. Fake luxury products also found their market in China. Although now a rising number of Chinese people are able to afford real luxury goods, there are still many people who cannot afford to buy them. High quality counterfeit luxury products seem to be a good choice for these people to satisfy their own vanity. This is probably why the industry is so large. Those without money want to buy that rich person look. The high quality counterfeit products are so welcome because they really stand out from other fakes. These products are usually made in a one-to-one -one proportion. The manufacturers also try to use very close materials with the true products to produce these fakes. It's quite hard for consumers to distinguish out the fake luxury products. The characteristics of the high quality counterfeit products can actually meet the demand for a few people who are not able to buy the real products but still want to own them and show them off. These high quality counterfeit luxury products include handbags, watches, sunglasses, and perfume. Most of their prices are 10% of the cost of real ones. For instance, Chanel's classic medium handbag is usually sold for about 6,600 US dollars for each one. The high quality counterfeit product is about 450 US dollars for each one. Most fake luxury producers choose to sell their products through WeChat. It's very popular in China now and it's safer to sell fake products than in actual stores. A few people also choose to cooperate with these manufacturers to advertise their products with their friends on WeChat. By doing this, an individual can earn over $1,600 per month. The high quality counterfeit luxury products have gotten a lot of attention from Chinese net users. A few of them say that now many counterfeit luxury products really have a very high quality. One noted quote, I have to say that now a few counterfeit luxury products are quite close to those true ones. Many people are willing to pay for them, mainly because the quality is relatively high. And the most important thing is that they are much cheaper than the genuine products. These counterfeit products indeed make a certain group of people's demands. Some other net users point out that if the counterfeit luxury producers can make high-quality counterfeits, they might try to make their own brands. One suggested quote, in my view, if those counterfeit producers have the ability to make high-quality knockoff products, then they might have the strength to try to make their own brands. It's a better way for them. After all, counterfeit products are illegal in the market. Some other net users express their views on those buyers of counterfeit luxury products. Many of them express that those buyers are pathetic to some extent. One said, quote, it's stupid for people to meet their vanity through buying high-quality, counterfeit luxury products. Actually, they're pathetic to some extent. They try to play dress up as a rich person, but rich people don't need luxury products to prove themselves. And real rich people won't buy knockoff products anyways. Another net user also joked, quote, I really don't understand why so many people choose to buy knockoff products. For a poor person, people won't even believe that is real, let alone if it is a fake one. So it's not worthwhile to spend money on fake products. Now, high-quality fake luxury products are popular among many Chinese consumers. But obviously, people don't buy the fakes because they want quality. They do it because they want to exploit the value of the label to appear rich and fashionable. But as long as China doesn't stop the sales of fakes, there isn't much reason for them to buy the real products if they're really copied well.